Hello, Leo. There's a present coming to you. <laughs> uh, but I don't know. Maybe somebody is giving you gifts. I feel like um, maybe somebody is in need or something. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, but I feel like people are going to start getting stuff that they really want. That's what I'm feeling like here. All right. What's going on? Leo, Leo, Leo. It's my lady from Malay's Way Terry. Now coming to do your weekly reading for the week of 9 11 through 9 18 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to make sure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Oops, sorry. And let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Leo, Leo, Leo? Leo love reading. Leo love reading. 9, 11 through 9, 18, 2017. Leo love. 9, 11 through 9, 18, 2017. Love reading, love reading, love reading. Mm. I don't feel like people are letting go of child's parents right now. I don't know. And this is everybody. I know it's not everybody because everybody doesn't have parent uh children. But um, I'm just seeing flashes of like arguments, and then I feel like it's over school clothes. Okay, so I don't know. Maybe that's for a specific person, specific people. But that's what I keep seeing right now. Okay. So what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Leo, Leo, Leo. 9, 11 through 9, 18, 2017. Leo, love reading. 9, 9, 9, 9, 9. 11, 9, 18, 2017. All right, guys. So somebody is not treating the other person right. Um, since it's here, Leo, I feel like somebody's treating you. I'm getting a feeling like somebody's treating you like they don't want to be bothered, okay? Leo, 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 love reading. All right, so it seems like here is not this, whatever this relationship is not looking good for the future. I mean, you can see here, he's laying there like, oh, whatever, and she's just all over him. And it's basically telling me here that, like, no matter what you do, you're not going to make this person happy or could be vice versa. They they won't make you happy no matter what they do, how far they go. All right, we got a flipper. All right, wow. Okay, so, Leo, this is saying you may be the one, but this could be reversed. Um, You just keep in and out of this person's life, in and out of this person's life, and this person is doing everything that they can to try to keep you around. Oh, geez, I just choked. <laughs> Sorry. But uh, they just don't want them. You just don't want them. Maybe it's because of the feeling that you're being choked. You're being smothered by this person. And this could be the reason that you're leaving, okay? All right, what's going on with the Leo, Leo? All right, that go to present card again. So, yeah, in this situation, I feel like, like no matter if you give this person gifts or not it's not going to do a difference you know it don't matter it's not good enough okay all right so um i'm feeling like i'm feeling like this person really cares for you Really, really cares for you. And I think they might have did something in the past. I'm feeling like they might have did something. Uh, but I feel like it might be exaggerated to the point where it's just like, now you may be being a bad person, but you're not looking at yourself as bad because there's one little thing this person did wrong. Okay, in some cases, my little things ain't y'all little things, so... It might have been a big thing, but um, I don't know. This person really trying to get back with you. Okay, so 
either this situation didn't happen that long ago or this person this the craziness just start happening out of the blue like less than three months ago or this could be a relationship that's less than three sorry three months old okay i want to see what this present is about what is this present about for the leo leo love reading 9 11 through 9 18 2017 Mmm. Okay. Okay. Mm. It seems like you might have sacrificed something for this person in the past. So, I mean, any kind of sacrifice, if we get this card, then it, it must have been a, a big deal to the individual and habit to but I feel like you sacrifice something and now this person is trying to repay you with little bits but it's not good enough all right let's do the Cleo cards and see what's coming out from there but this somebody was um demasculated somebody was brought back down to earth and I feel like this is after the whole event like this is all right let's say um If the Leo was the masculine party in here, he he or she was brought down. Like something like really threw, shoved them in the ground for what they did. Now it's like, I don't know, people trying to make sacrifice to get, get back in good graces with somebody. That's what I'm feeling. Yeah, but yes, I feel like somebody was humiliated in some way. Okay. Let's go. All right, what's going on with uh, Leo, 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 love reading 4, 9, 11 through 9, 18, 2000, 17, 9, 11 through 9, 18, 2017, Leo, love reading. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Leo, Leo. Okay, so, mm, yeah, um, to me, this is somebody is not communicating their love. They're not telling you how they feel about you. Okay, yes, yeah, so I do feel like somebody might have left somebody. Uh, it was an ex, and they're trying to reclaim this um, happiness that they had after. Um, but it seems like somebody won't talk to the other person. Yeah, about secrets that came out, so. Mm, okay. All right, so I don't know. Here, it makes me feel like somebody said was trying to take a trip, or said they was taking a trip, and they really didn't go anywhere. Or if they did go on this trip, I feel like the other partner couldn't go, and it was no communication with this situation. And I feel like it might be having to do with somebody and they ex. Okay. All right. What's at the bottom of this? Oh, yeah, look at him trying to, well, this to me reversed, like somebody's trying to bring back things that they stole. So you're like, you didn't ruin this person emotion, emotionally, or this person ruined you emotionally, or just dampered your um, feelings about people, and then here they come crawling back, okay? Mm. All right, so we have the Eight of Cups first, and the Eight of Cups is reversed, and it says... Um, elaborate celebration, proclaimed happiness, and gatherings, new possibilities can be created when you look in alternate directions. So it's basically like, I don't know, I, I feel like it's telling you like this relationship is just not going to work out. I mean, I guess you already know that. That's why you keep leaving now that this person then done you wrong. But now that I'm thinking about this card, maybe... Maybe you could be the one leaving right now and acting like you're somewhere you're not. All right, let's read these. All right, we got the Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups is upright. It says, after much work, you will be rewarded for your efforts. Be careful not to appear both full and vain. 
Mm. Okay, so this is basically saying, the cards are saying, I don't feel this way that, you know, you keep giving this person what they want and they're going to come back. But even if they do come back, they still going to treat you like crap. I mean, they, they don't forgive you, okay? All right, the moon, the moon, the moon. The moon is reversed. And it says, frequent mistakes and emotional dilemmas. So, um, okay, maybe this could be you, the one that's leaving. Because the frequent mistakes, I, I keep seeing somebody arguing and then somebody leaving. And then they coming back, arguing, leaving, coming back. And I just feel like it might be some kind of ritual, like... Like, are you making this person leave or is this person making you leave? You know, it's like, do I know if I'm in control of this or is this other person? You know what I'm saying? All right, so we have the Knight of Staffs here. And he's reversed. Um, severing of connections. Emotional or physical separation. So, yeah, I'm feeling like this is that leave, come back, leave, come back thing. But, I mean, the overall of, of everything is like, maybe it's time to look somewhere else. You know, because every time you go back, it's the same thing. Mm. All right, so now we got the five of swords. And it is reversed, so it says... Um, a card of decision and consequences, consequences, moving away from people or an environment, letting go. And then upside down, it just say utter shame. It is. This is sad, you know. And I don't see any love cards there. So I'm like, you guys are doing this for materialistic reasons and convenience of being with somebody. But I don't know. Whatever floats your boat. That's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Send me an email. We can set something up. Other than that, make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. And everybody, let's pray for everybody affected by these storms. You know, I mean, there's nothing much we can do. We can donate here and there. But what we can do the most is pray that everybody is okay. Other than that, you guys have a great week.